think my most memorable moment was the summer after my freshman year. I had decided to study abroad in Germany, studying um, the German language. And for the first three days, it was a really nerve-wracking experience. And then the Tuesday after I had arrived over the weekend, I had this moment where I was walking down the street and someone spoke to me in German and I was able to respond in German. And I suddenly realized that it was going to be an amazing month, and it was. And it gave me such a newfound sense of confidence. We started a General Assembly at Macaulay about like a year and a half ago and it started off just as a place for discussion. Eventually more people came and we said there's this conference in Boston we want to go to it and we have these ideas about higher education and we ended up with a whole room full of people talking about what it means to be a Macaulay student and what it means to be a CUNY student and that was like for me the epitome of what Macaulay is that you're really like self-reflective and you're part of this larger system but you're also part of this really cool little community of people. I had the opportunity to research with uh, Dean Kirshner my sophomore year. I went into the files of um, the first floor division of the New York Public Library on Fifth Avenue and I got to touch books that were as yellowed and dusty as the centuries. <laughs> and at the end, I got to put it all together in a comprehensive view of what I did that whole year and I got to present it to a group of scholars and students and it really was the most rewarding, I think, experience of my college career. I started this independent study with uh, my psychology advisor, Jason Young. I think through that, through that independent study I started with him, I, I realized my love of psychology and cognitive science and it really shifted my entire academic career. Now I plan to go to grad school and become a professor in the discipline. Uh, I'm a member of the Macaulay Triplets and I have been for about one year uh, since it started and I'm the oldest member, I'm the only senior. <laughs> and so for me it's it's a really special experience to, to see a bunch of young people, people who are younger than me in Macaulay from a lot of different backgrounds and various campuses getting together and making music. It was really nice for me to kind of take a break from studying and doing all the things that I normally associated with Macaulay before my junior year and, and start singing with Macaulay people.